Hey everyone, how you guys doing? I know you're like, what am I looking at? This is a video about blanket storage or any kind of storage. Shh. Mommy doing video. Um, I got these cubbies and these are like 288 or 388 at Walmart. This is the smaller cubbies and this is how I keep my blankets, you guys. It's, uh, I think it's called the file system. Um, the secret is <laughs> they have to mostly be the same size. Like all these blankets are the same size and you have to fold them identically. Um, and that's it, you guys. So, um, I think this is 20 blankets in here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 blankets in one cubby. Um, let me go get my measuring tape, you guys. Hold on a second. Sorry about that. Let's see the dimensions. I'm sorry. So, 11. It's 11 by 11. So, I mean, this could go in a closet or... It's very versatile. That's why I love it. I actually got Joy a cube system, a nine cube system in her room. And she has a lot of different things in there, toys and books and stuff like that. I really love the cube system because it can be a shelf or you can put a cubby in it. Or you can just stack stuff in it by itself without the actual fabric box. But I just love these. I wish I could get cube systems all over my house. I just think they're amazing. I like stuff stacked and I like stuff neat and stuff hidden. So this is some of my blankets. Y'all know I have a blanket obsession. And these are all my thermals. So that's one. I have two. <laughs> And I actually have blankets in another area. These are the blankets I go to most of the time. I just got this one and washed it. So I haven't, um, well, I washed all these new ones I just got. Um, because I just had that one at first and then I needed another one. And she had a empty, some empty baskets. So here are my other blankets and this holds one, two. I still have room. I could put some more receiving blankets in here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I think this can hold two more. I may can go ahead and put that one in here. So these are all my receiving, well, most of my receiving blankets. My new little elephant. And these are my two muslin blankets. And I have two white thermals. Um, one I like more than the other. <laughs> it depends on what's on them. Like, I think... Um, this is the one I like, yeah. This is the one I like that says baby on it. The other thermal, mm, it has something else on it that I didn't really like. I think it has a bear or something. And, you know, I get all my blankets from the thrift store. Oh, it has that. That's not too bad. Um, All my blankets from the thrift store except this one. This pack I just bought from... Ross for $9.99. It had this one and this one in it. So, But everything else, all my other blankets come from the thrift store. All these were $0.55. Cents. These may have been a dollar. So um, I have some more blankets because I love blankets. Um, mild obsession. You got your strawberry? I'm just putting it in the back. Uh oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I shook the camera. I didn't fold it tight enough. Um, so I just wanted to give you guys um, some suggestions of what you could do if you if you um, have a lot of things you need to store. Like I have a lot of blankets. Um, this is one option of how you can store them. And I showed you guys the two bins that I got from Target that I had under the bed. I really didn't like that. Um, so I found another place for them. They're actually in my laundry room. And I think that's okay because they're air locked. But we'll see. Because you know when the dryer's on, stuff sweats. 
in the in the laundry room. Y'all know my favorite color is purple, and I got this one because we're doing Minnie Mouse. So to me, this was Minnie Mouse polka dots. <laughs> Um, if you guys want to see how I fold them to put them in here like this, just comment below and let me know. But whenever I have some information, I like to share it with you guys because when I first came into the community, there were people who were doing free tutorials. They were just showing how they packed their diaper bags, how they did their, how they made form, fake formula for their bottles, how they magnetized their pacifiers, how they... Um, reweight their babies how they did all kind of stuff so I really um, learned a lot and I really appreciate the people that just did videos like that so whenever I find out some information I always oh my goodness I'm so sorry I like to share <laughs> have a good day you guys